The sons of King Pharaoh himself. It's a big moment. It's a big moment. Don't need a diamond, some cool. Black boy just shine like the moon. No some rebels in seven. Hey. No, they watch your tune. All of my niggas are bones. All of my niggas are. Hey. Oh. I'll be running with gunning. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Them think they funny. Come here talking. This is Generation Z for you, honey bunny. Come here, get sick of The king himself. It's a big moment. I hope you have your speaker plugged in. I hope you are tuned into these vibes. We have King on the line. You know that I'm popping champagne on my real niggas brain. I'm, a, I'm just gonna go ahead and give you a quick bio of him as as we uh kind of enjoy his his vibes in the background i'm gonna go ahead and give you a little introduction to the man himself before we give him the microphone it is king farrah okay and the raw is an r capital r if you need to get it correct capital r o a r it's about a raw it's a raw ting I, I feeling I'm feeling lion vibes over here. I'm feeling, you know, I'm feeling a lot of power in this name. A 21 year old from Harare, Zimbabwe, based in Canada. Um, that's Manitoba, Winnipeg. If I have that correct, I know I do. So he's joining us right from across the world. As you know, Nightcap, we're broadcasting right here from Kabroni, Botswana. We're broadcasting right here from Khaboroni, Botswana, and uh, yeah, what we love about After Five is the fact that we can, what we love about After Five is the fact that we can connect internationally to our people all over the world. So yeah, I'm really excited to be welcoming King Pharaoh. He says he got into music early this year, actually, so he's really, really fresh into the game um he was in a group called young black kings uh, aka ybk um and they didn't release um a song together though they broke up not too long ago um but thereafter he started working on his own grind and this is um what we are listening to now this is what we've been listening to now and what we're gonna listen to um ahead so as i said chat to us let us know how you're feeling about the vibes um so far in his music career he says that he's had the opportunity um to have one of his songs and that's the song legend that we played right before um right before this one and he it would it debuted at one of his local clubs that's at the bar red sea um and that was a huge thing for him having people bang to his uh to his music you know having people oh lord okay is bang the right word <laughs> I'm not sure if bang is the right word, but you know, having people vibe to, to his vibe, you know, out in the club. Um, so that's that's a highlight that he's had. Can we clap hands for homeboy? together for King Pharaoh. Um He's also had his song uh, play, his songs, his music played at, at Fort Richmond um, in Canada for the Black History Month. Uh, and yeah, it's been events and events. Um, and so it's, it's, yeah, it's exciting. But he is, you know, he is just coming in. So it's going to be very interesting to have, to have a fresh perspective, you know. Uh, but let, listen, before before I go on, before I go further, I'm going to bring King Pharaoh in. King Pharaoh, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you loud and Are you here? What's up? Hey, 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 hey. What's up? What's up? What's good? After 5 Radio, what's up? <laughs> what's good? After 5 Radio welcomes you. Welcome to the nightcap. Thank you very much. Thank you. What's up? What's good? How are you feeling? I'm feeling kind of nervous. Are uh, you still feeling nervous? You know, yeah, because of the song I'm about to uh, release. It's not really a rap song, so I'm waiting to see how people react to it, you know? Mm, 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 mm. Listen, breathing, breathing is always a plan, I'll tell you that. Oh, I'll yeah. tell you, yeah. breathing in and out is always a plan. But listen, there's nothing, there's nothing really to be too nervous about, I think um i think we're gonna love it listen art is art okay <laughs> art is art so even yeah, definitely, if <laughs> definitely. 
<laughs> yeah, even if it's you know, even if it's the worst thing on on earth, listen, you you created it and it's beautiful because it's something that you created, okay? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, um King, before we get into the music, I really really want to get to know you a little bit and I know our after five family wants to get to know you and the listeners also want to get to know you a little bit so could you give us a, a, a brief uh, or not so brief listen we've got time give us a little bit of insight into who King Pharaoh is well um, I guess I'll start with the name the name itself came from the idea of well I'm guessing my listeners uh, my name's Ashwana um yes hit us with that shuma. shona yes you know mutupo angu shuma saka uh, when i made the name the king part of it was like you know a lion being king of the jungle and um and then pharaoh was from the mixtape of one of my favorite artists uh Travis scott and i didn't just rewrote it to roar at the end because of my totem nice. so that's how the name came about i love that there's a little bit of depth to that wow you know a lot of people just slap on names that sound cool which is fine mm-hmm. but i love that you've taken it back home you know that you oh, that yeah, you've I, dug I, I into the, my roots you've dug into the roots yeah oh yeah and um i guess more to know about me is i'm i love i love vibes you know if you hear the next one that um that i just released today it's all about vibes i'm all i'm a person who loves happy energy yeah uh, i love just you know being in a good space especially mentally because these days it's hard to stay mentally grounded and stable won't you tell me about it won't you tell me about it oh. yeah no absolutely oh. cool 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 so tell me something now for our international listeners who don't understand kutichupo chi because uh, we are after five that after five we we do have an international audience although we are promoting artists like yourself zimbos that are out in the world doing the most yes ma'am so let us know yes, to Pachi, when you really you know if, if, if the canadian says listen king uh what what where'd you get your name from could you say it for us in english nice nice okay um mutupo is basically totem in in english right yeah. so i guess in another way i could say my family animal you know like that the animal that represents my family best is a lion yeah and the the king part being the the lion king of the jungle yeah and then the roar part being because of my totem for my family there animal there we go there we go fire 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 okay so now you are in canada right now uh i know that you are a student yeah yeah so you're a student doing music at the same time um let us know what you're studying what you know what what are we doing what yeah what, what are we studying in canada um and how's it going trying to balance the two i'm studying architecture at the university of manitoba mm-hmm. and the balance is kind of hectic should i say because you know i have to balance um being in class um being in the studio and doing my assignments and just being, you know, yeah. a normal student. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's hard because I have to raise my grades to my parents, of course. My all, all my Zim people know what I'm talking about. All my Zim people know. Um and You don't need to tell us twice. At the same time I'm trying to you know, and at the same time I'm trying to create this this art and give it to the people because I I don't know, I've always just found music to be the best way to express yourself and that's how I've chosen to express myself. Okay. okay. Awesome. Awesome stuff. No that balance is important. Keep those grades. <laughs> it's it's good that you know your priorities, fam. Because the the parents know. don't play. Yeah, even if you even if I end up doing well in, in, in music to say that you know I'm I'm the best there is. I, my parents would still definitely be a factor in that. So I got to keep them happy, you know. Yeah. 100% fam 100% so kids listening in stay in school is what king pharaoh is saying <laughs> push the Please, passion school is important right push the passion but don't you know diamonds and cool but stay in school oh yeah it's, it's, you got you got to stay in school too cuz honestly it's good like people don't talk about this much but it's good to have a backup plan because mm. you know 
honestly, anyone can make it in music and <laughs> anyone can, you know, be torn down just as fast as they were built up. Yep. So having a backup plan is a good idea yeah. for those who are thinking, you know, I might not stop doing school because I made it in music. Nah, if you can get the degree while you're doing music, please, by all means. Yo, some wisdom there, man. Some real wisdom over there. Listen, uh, King, we're going to continue our conversation. We're going to continue our conversation after, you know, this quick break. Um, but just know we are here and we're super, super excited. I want to just remind our listeners as we jam to legend right now playing in the background. Listen, we are going to be launching um, King Pharaoh's latest single and we want you to to go ahead and um, get your fingers ready to give us feedback, get those voice notes starting to come in. Well, not starting, but get those voice notes ready because we do we do want to give King some feedback. Let us know what we think about his track. Celebrate with him because it's a huge thing, man. It's a huge thing. So as soon as um, we're done with this, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go right ahead and get in to it so so yeah so we're gonna do that um right on the other side right on the other side of this This hi this is rosella and you're tuned into after five radio Yo, what's going on, people? It's your boy Kaz, aka Mr. Boomslang, and you are now rocking with the best After Five Radio. Boomslang in any place. You're listening to After Five Radio, radio, the best in Zimbabwe and diaspora music. Time check right now is twenty-two eleven. That's uh, 11 minutes past 10 right here, Central African time. If you're just tuning in, you're hanging out with myself, Samantha K, right here on the nightcap. If you're new to the station, it is After 5 Radio. Our mission is to bring you the best vibes possible. We're here to have you have a relaxing night, have a good night. Enjoy the vibes with us playing the best of Zimbabwe's diaspora music. We have on the line, and this is a a first um, for us here at After Five with this particular artist. It is King Pharaoh in the building. We've been chatting to him. Yes, 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 sir. (laughs) We've been chatting to him about, yeah, himself. He's introduced himself, Zimbo Harare boy based in Canada. Pursuing the music dream. King, let me know. Um, let us know real quick, King, uh, the story with the, the band that you're with before and, you know, what that was about and then just generally your music career so far. Okay. Um, I guess, so with the group that I was in, it was basically just, you know, four guys, you know, we... We went to the same school and we said, you know, we started freestyling at school uh, this one day. Um, and we just decided, you know what, why don't we just try to do this over a beat? We did it over a beat and it sounded great. And we're like, why not just, you know, just do this. So we started actually making headway into launching the group officially. Yeah. And, you know, as most groups go, things went south and, <laughs> you know, we broke up. Yeah. You know, you know, personal issues in there, you know, little little years in there. Um, and then yeah. at that point, I was kind of confused because the way I started doing music was because of the group. Mm. And I kind of didn't know which way to go after that because everything about music for me was to do with the group. So I kind of took some time introspecting yeah. and figuring out what I'm about, yeah. what I want people to hear when they hear me. Yeah. And from there, it just kind of became easy to just go in the studio and write what I'm feeling. Awesome. So how would you categorize yourself right now? Uh, would you call yourself a hip-hop artist? How would you categorize yourself in terms of genre? I wouldn't confine myself to one genre because I feel like that's a trap, you know? 
it, it, it then becomes something like maybe if I'm if I feel like singing a jazz song and I'm good at it, now I can't because I'm a hip hop artist or or a, you know yeah. or a different kind of yeah. genre of artist. So I I don't like saying I'm a specific genre. I prefer to say you know I'm just an artist. Sure. Okay. Just doing what I do. Okay. But does your music lean towards one or two or three um, genres at least? Mainly hip hop and R&B. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, King, you are 21 years old. Yes, ma'am. I was listening to your music and I really felt like, and you know, this is coming from someone that's a little bit older. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am a little bit older and you know I don't usually I'm not I'm not I'm not one for trap and you know mainstream hip hop not really R&B yes um mm-hmm. hip hop with a bit of soul yeah. yes but I was listening to yeah. your music I was like is this coming from a 21 year old for real I feel like there's such a maturity oh, to your music not 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 in a boring way but like there's there's a there's a lot more depth I think than than I expected from someone your age. I don't know. I don't know if that's intentional. Is it intentional? Uh, yeah. Cause I would like like there's a lot of times that I listen to like, um, maybe somebody that I know, and it's like, yeah, I know that I can hear that you have talent, but you're missing something. And sometimes instead of you know just saying that and leaving it at that, I'll go home. And I'll kind of fix about myself what I saw in them, if that makes sense. Right. So that and the fact that I write poetry by myself, yeah. you know, it, it it then kind of just blends into a nice mix of lyrics when I need them. Hectic. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. So just to make sure that I've understood, did you just tell me that when you see a flaw in someone or when you see something that, you know, is kind of offish about a person, you use that to introspect? and see if that thing is also present in you to try and fix it also in yourself yeah that is so deep dude i love uh, that it, it, it's just uh, it's, it's a lot of you know life experiences I, I went through a lot this year so yeah 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 well you know sometimes they say the worst of life can you know turn into the best of life you know sometimes you make lemonade out of lemons and sounds like that's what you're trying to do really really dope thank you appreciate it all right so as we now get into the drop the actual drop i want you to give us a little bit of background about this particular song um that we're going to listen to in a bit uh but before we do that i want to remind our listeners um once again guys you are tuned in to after five radio with myself samantha claire on the nightcap and we have king pharaoh um an artist and i'm calling him the new kid on the block and he's debuting his um latest single in a few minutes it's going to be playing on air um for the first time and so um to get in touch with us please go ahead and hit us up on our facebook and twitter um that's at after five radio uh we have a instagram as well which is at after five radio zim but if you want to send through your shout outs your voice notes um your comments we have a direct whatsapp line that you can uh yeah do that too and the number to contact us is um plus one seven zero one seven nine three nine eight nine zero that number again is plus one seven zero one seven nine three nine eight nine zero so can go right ahead and and just introduce the the song the the single um give us the whole nine yards about about this about this particular project okay um the song is called can you see and i wrote it about my girlfriend (laughs) okay yeah current current um, or past if that's not too much information to ask uh, current okay okay yeah so basically with this song it was just 
with my girlfriend there was a time when um she said no actually and you know we went through a whole series of me and my male ego going oh you know she said no uh, and then um eventually it worked out but in the time that we were kind of seeing where things can go i i i said a, a rhythm and melody in my head and i didn't stop with it until i found the beat for it and now when i was writing i was just it was harder for me to stay in tune with what i was feeling because at the time i was also trying to make some rap music and stuff which i have in the vault um but me thinking about her and channeling my my thoughts toward her helped a lot with the writing process and everything which is really good yeah sure sure i will i will say no more uh ladies and gentlemen <laughs> king pharaoh are you ready for the actual debut I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Y'all ready? I think we're definitely ready. All right. So please introduce. I'm going to allow you to introduce the track thing. Um introduce it and I'm going to go right ahead and play it. It's called Can You See by King Pharaoh featuring Jasty Nam. Boom 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 boom. <laughs> By night, yeah, he going crazy. Mm-hmm. I feel a way about your energy, it's heavenly. The vibes is cool, yeah, we making us some memories. We got the love, yeah, we making us a recipe. Stop all that talk, you know, these hoes they don't mean shit to me. I try to tell you, you are the one for me. I try to tell you, you are the one for me. Are you the one? Is you the one for me? Are you the one? Oh baby, can you see? I need a girl that can just help me on this ride. You came along and you became my ride or die, girl. The messages I'm texting, girl, this love got me distant. If I lost it all today, would you just drop me in and listen, girl? I need you by my side. Ain't nobody here tonight. It's just you and me, a legacy, and everything feels right. Sipping good, you're sipping a Sprite. Darkest tunnel, bring me a light. For your love, you know I'm a fight. Ain't no barking, baby, I'll buy it. Yeah. Baby, just show me your way. Give me all the love you got, cause girl, you know I'm a stay. We can be driving around the city, I'ma roll you with Jay. So tell me, baby, how night. you want it? Yeah, no time for no pain. I feel a way about your energy, it's heavenly. The vibes is cool, yeah, we making us some memories. We got the love, yeah, we making us a recipe. Stop all that talk, you know these hoes, they don't mean shit to me. I try to tell you. You are the one for me. I try to tell you, you are the one for me. Are you the one? Is you the one for me? Are you the one? Oh baby, can you see? Are you the one that I can call and I be down all on my own and all my boys they turn their back so I'm sitting all alone. I need a girl to have my back when I be running towards the throne. I'm in my zone but I can't stand to be observed by all these clones. Are you the one that I can blow a bag on? But you're humble and I know that you ain't want my bags now You the one that coming over just to chill Laid up in my shoes so we can go and grab a meal All that you can eat If I lost it all, would you tell me you love me still? Can you tell me if this thing we got is really real? If I made it big, would you promise to never change? Are you the one who never switch up and would stay the same? I feel a way about your energy, it's heavenly. It's heavenly. The love is cool, yeah, we making us some memories. Some memories. We got the love, yeah, we making us a recipe. Stop all that talking, all these hoes, they don't mean shit to me. I try to tell you, you are the one for me. I try to tell you, you are the one for me.
see the need to hide back how i feel about anything so i try and channel that into my music cuz i can give my fans uh, not just some music to listen to but you know like a part of me you know yeah. yo you yeah. yeah. like the, the second hook yeah um when i then added the high note behind the low note on the chorus That that's when I was like okay people should really feel this. Okay, I'm going to have to listen re-listen to that that particular part. But I'm just like okay, vibe, I'm vibing to it, you know, as we as we speak and I know you may not be able to hear it and maybe you're just hearing my silence but I'm just I'm just really vibing to I'm just really vibing to it and I want to throw it out to the listeners. Give us your feedback on this new branger this new kid on the block the new track on the block it was a donna made my zone but i can't stand to be a zerba all these clowns you the one that i can blow a bag on but you're humble and i know that you ain't want my bags now you the one that come in over just to chill need up in my shit so we can go and why why the name can you see Um the name is can you see because like I said at the time she initially said no to me and I was trying to convince her that you know I'm the guy So it's more like so, yeah can you see that can you finally see that I'm the one I'm the one that you need to be chilling with Exactly you know I'm the one that you need to be with Sure And did she see did she see King Pharaoh? Yeah, she did. She saw it and she and she was pretty happy about Dude, it. Dude, I hope she had it on repeat. I hope she's listening in. Oh yeah, she is. She's listening from home. King Pharaoh's Bay. Let us know you're listening and send us a message. Send us a voice note. Let us know how proud you are of Homeboy. Uh I certainly am very proud of you, King. I'm honored that you were able to, you know, debut the song right here. It's yeah definitely going to be on our playlist 100% for sure for sure and for sure thank you very much thank you thank you i'm going to be i will wait for it to reply actually i'm let me text her and tell her to put it in awesome yeah do that do that king i'm going to be um reading out messages uh, reading out voice notes and any feedback that i have uh from you know from from people that have been listening Uh whilst I do that um I'm going to play Ration now um we we heard we heard some of his his song like the one the, the song that we heard before you know as we were waiting um was was uh was a rationale track so I'm going to go ahead and play another one of his his tracks um as we wait for for the calls and and for the messages well the voice notes and the messages to come here so after 5 fam um night cap fam get get those messages coming and let us know what you feel what you think about king pharaoh's song debut right here first um on after 5 radio first on the night cap um we're going to get to some of your messages that i see coming in uh right on the other side <laughs> Of this this is rationale featuring i yell and the name of this strong song is hurts the most we throw reality away 
Thankfully, King Pharaoh is not in any hurt right now because she said yes and she can see. <laughs> others are still in. Oh yes. Yeah. Others are still in 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 a bit of you know pain because Aish, hey, you know, it doesn't always go the way that we want it to go. You know, with love. Oh yeah, it doesn't. For me, it, it, it almost didn't. But you know, you gotta thank God. <laughs> Clearly, the the thing is to write to write the girl a song. <laughs> Oh yeah, the thing. Nah, I think she only heard the song way after she said yes. Like I was working on it as a as a release for my emotions about the whole thing. Hectic. So, so. she didn't hear the song before, so it was more. Hey, okay, it means that you did quite a good job, sir, of you know presenting yourself as the suitable candidate. Yeah, definitely. Like I, I, I honestly feel like with relationships, if you feel like the person's the one, then. You gotta do everything yeah. in your power to do, you know, to get what you want. Yeah. No, that's fantastic, man. King, let me see you on the other side um, of the rest of this track, yeah? Okay. Awesome. The best Zimbabwean diaspora music. After Five Radio. After Five Radio, your station for brand new hits. Brand new hits. If you've just tuned in, we are on the line with King Pharaoh himself. Brand new hit from King Pharaoh, debuting right here on the night cap. Yes, sir, man. New kid on the block. What's up? What's good, sir? What's good? Hey. Vibes are up right now. I've just been getting a lot of good feedback, and it just feels great. Yeah, same here. I've got a listener saying, "Play that song again, Sam. Play that song again." So this is what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, appreciate you. Did they give you a name? No. Shout out? out to Sugar AA. That's DJ Sugar. He said, "Listen, play that song again." And he's actually asking, "Did you just confirm?" Um, that shooting your shots is the thing to do. Uh, this is a question actually from DJ Sugar. He's actually one of our After Five radio hosts. Oh, okay. All right. All right. What's up, DJ Sugar? Hey, hey, hey. Shout out. So, King Pharaoh, he's asking, did you just confirm uh, with your story about your girl, did you just confirm that shooting your shots is the way to go? You know, when things are looking a bit rocky, would you then confirm, you know, from your experience that it's good to still shoot your shot and still try aim, you know, even when it looks like you keep missing? Um, I would say be smart about it because you don't want to shoot your shot too much and then become like a creep. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it's very easy to go from being the, the cute guy in, in our messages to being borderline creep, you know? So you just got to play it careful. <laughs> you got to play it smart. And you gotta see if she's actually like you know if there's a chance mm. from the way she's moving toward you, like if there's a chance for the for the two of you. If you can't see that, then maybe I would say don't shoot your shot until you're sure that you might hit the rim. Mm. Some wisdom. Listen, King Fire, we're gonna go back to that message, uh, to that convo just now, okay? But I don't want to. I don't want to forget this this shout out that I've just um, that I've received as well from one of our listeners. This is Andrew uh, from Lancashire, UK. Let's see what Andrew has to say. All right, all right. Hey, um, I just want to find out. Uh, yeah, King Faro, nice song. Hey, nice song, and I like the relation um, of the song to to your storyline and um, events in your life about your. Uh, or should I say girl or girlfriend? Are you dating now? Did she really see you? Has she noticed you? Uh, how's that going? How's that going? Um, is there another follow-up track? If you are now dating, is there a follow-up track to say, okay, now we're dating and then this is what you can sing for her. If you're not dating, is there a follow-up track to say, okay, we didn't date, but I tried. Good one, eh? I like that. Well, there you have it. Uh... We've got our homeboy asking you, is there a new one maybe in the pipeline, uh, Mr. King? Uh, is there a new one in the pipeline now that we've got the girl? 
Um, oh yeah, hell yeah. I've got a couple things in the vault, a couple things coming up. I won't speak too much on it, but y'all just better keep tuned in, follow my Instagram and get all the updates. Okay, cool, 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 cool. And I'm gonna definitely be asking you for your um your contact handles. For your contact handles uh, as soon as here's another voice note. Uh here's another voice note. We love note. the song King Pharaoh. It's amazing. It's really Honestly, nice. It's, like it's on top. It's ten yes. out of ten. It's lit. Definitely recommend. Love that. Love that. Love that. Did you recognize those voices, King? Nah, like I, I actually can't really hear the voice note through oh, through the phone. Oh snap. Oh man. Okay, so that was that was a voice note from some girls saying, uh, and there's a group of them. They're saying, "Oh my gosh, we love the track. We love it." I'm gonna send you these voice notes, um, Pharaoh, when when we're done with this, just for you to appreciate and and yes, please, yes, please. And yeah, I'm just remembering, of course, with our with the way that we've called in, you can't actually hear what's in my ear, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, exactly. No, it's all good. I'll just listen to it after. You just tell me what you're saying. Okay, cool. Um, there's another one that's just come in. Let me just go ahead and hear what Sugar's saying. Yo, yo, King Pharaoh. Your song gets the sweet nod from the sugar. It's been a- Actually, you know what, King Pharaoh? This is what I'm going to do. Let me know if you can hear this. Uh, do you hear a song play, King? Yeah, very faint. Very faint. Okay, let me let me see if you if you can hear this because I want you to hear it straight from the horse's mouth. Yo, yo, King Pharaoh. Your song gets the sweet nod from the sugar. It's been approved. That's a good song, man. Keep it up, keep it up. Good job, good job. And guess what? You have to tune in this Saturday. Who knows, man? You could be in the future top twenty. Much love. Sugar uh, out. Yes, sir. That's DJ Sugar, man. I oh, appreciate the love. Oh, my. Oh, oh my. <laughs> so, so, King Pharaoh, we have an After 5 Radio Top 20 that comes on. Uh, well, we, we, did, we listen to our, our Top 20 um, nominated artists and people get to vote on the songs that they want to make the actual Top 20. Uh, so, you know, uh, the... the, the, the the top 20 man himself, Sugar A, is like, listen, you know, you may be coming in as one of our future. That's exciting for sure. That's really exciting, actually. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Everybody go vote. If you can hear me right now, please go vote for my song. I want to hear in that 2020. A, A, A. Vote, vote, vote. Uh, we've got another song coming, not a song, but another message saying, OMG, exclamation mark. I love the song. Um, the first time I listened to the song, I was really moved and I just love the vibes and the energy flowing throughout the music. I'm so proud of you, baby. This is King Pharaoh's girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hit her up. <laughs> Bless up. A shout out to you. What is her name? Let's give her a proper shout out. Hey, her name is Queen. You know, this message says, Yes, tell him Queen says hi. Is her name Queen for real? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Queen. Come on. A Queen for the King. Come on now. Hey. I mean, it only makes sense, you know? Things must make sense. And when they make, when they make sense, uh, we, we purr, 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 purr. That's what we do. That's a vibe. That's a vibe. I need to get all my horns and stuff in check so that... So that the next time I'm, you know, I'm yeah, I can I can bring those horns in nice and loud. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Oh, shout out to shout out to support. Shout out to support, man. It's not easy to find people that will be riding with you proper full on. Yeah, that's true. Like, I won't lie. This whole music thing kind of made me um, very aware of who's got me and who doesn't because i've seen a lot of my friends kind of drift um you know and it's not even like direct drifting that they don't say you know not talking to you anymore or anything it's just i don't see them doing something small like this you know reposting when i when i when i post my music you know even though when if it's the other way around 
you know i'm quick i'm quick with it you know all my friends know if you're doing something which which i fuck with it's like you know i'm quick with the whole reposting thing or whatever but you know i see some people can't really be the same yeah. and it's like you know it's just yeah. it's weird but i'm more focused on being the best up and comer out of zimbabwe come right on. now come on come on and focus is just what you need man uh yeah no focus on the grind and you've clearly got the grind on because this is a true ashem this is a true banger my friend thank you very much appreciate your love we're gonna um we're going to i want to you know before we wrap it up uh king fair i want you to share how we can get in touch with you um and then we're going to take a, a quick break and when we come on the other side of the break, uh, I really want to get into your head, uh, King Farrow, a little bit about this relationship advice that you're giving us over here about knowing that you're going to make that rip, make that dunk. Like you don't just go in for the dunk before you know that you're going to make it. Um, but before that, <laughs> before that, please like, let us know where can we find your music? Where can we listen to, where can we listen to Can You See? Uh, Can You See is now officially out on all platforms anywhere. YouTube, Apple Music, Spotify, Deezer, Pandora, Amazon Music, Google Play, anything you want to listen to it on is there. Nice, nice, nice. And how can we get in touch with you uh, personally? Your socials, any contacts for bookings, etc.? Um, I can give my Instagram and the booking email is on my Instagram too. Um, okay. So it's... Uh, king underscore pharaoh the way you write out my name so it's king underscore p-h-a-r-o-a-r sure sure nice 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 what uh awesome stuff so right on um right on the other side of this we're going to be getting more into conversation with king pharaoh himself uh we're going to be diving now into his thoughts on shooting your shot because listen i think a lot of us need some education on shooting shots proper um so we're going to be doing that right on the other side the nightcap with samantha claire on after five radio the best zimbabwean diaspora music after five radio That is, uh, uh, yo, I was about to say Rationale. Um, that was Hilsey with Destination, back-to-back with the Rationale track that's taking us up to exactly 10.50 right here on the nightcap. Of course, you are tuned into After 5 Radio. Of course, you are here with your girl, Samantha Clare. We do this from 9 p.m. all the way to midnight, Monday to Friday, and it's a 360 thing. It's, it's every week. Um, yeah. It's a situation. So if you're new here, welcome to the family. We chill, we chat um, over here. We get into the vibes and we talk. Uh, of course, sandwiched between some proper, 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 proper nice music. I hope you're hearing me nice and clean. I've now kind of set myself up so that uh, my listener will my guest can hear the music can hear the vibes and i hope that he can uh we have king pharaoh in the building the king himself hey 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 yeah so man we debuted king pharaoh's um latest single uh and and it's it's i've got to say it it hit the it hits it hit the buttons it hit the buttons. The name of the song is Can You See? I expect you to be hearing that definitely on our After 5 radio from our different hosts, um, on our different shows throughout the station for sure. We have it plugged in King Pharaoh, so know that we got you, boy. We got you. Yes, sir, man. Appreciate you all. All the love. So tell me, you were, you were, and this is not quickly King before, before I release you, I just need us and the listeners to just hear a little bit of your wisdom, because I think you've got, you know, quite the wisdom there, sir. <laughs> Thank you. Um, all right, what you guys want to hear? 
Okay, okay. What I want to hear is your specific comment on, you know, being sure about your shot before you shoot it. How can a homeboy be sure, Bam? How can he be sure? Um, I think the way I do it is I read body language, basically. Like, I don't know. I'm a very, I'm a person who, if I don't understand something, I'm very eager and willing to find out exactly what it is, what it's about. So there's a time I heard about body language a long time ago, I read on it, and I kind of started applying it in my life, started reading people a little bit, and that worked in my favor with women because it helps, it puts me in a position where I can see if I'm doing too much or not. Hmm. You know what I mean? Because I've seen, I've seen a whole lot of guys at different parties or the club who just do too much. And some, and like, they do it to, like, maybe even my, my female friends. And they're like, oh, look at this guy. And I'm like, sorry, man. It must be hard. So, <laughs> so wait, 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 repeat that. Know. Repeat that, King. I didn't get that, that one. Oh, um, so, yeah, like, I've seen a lot of guys, you know, who just do too much, whether it's in the club or at a party. Or, you know, and I've, like, even they do it to my female friends. And, you know, they just, they're like, this guy is doing too much. And I'm like, oh, okay, I, I, I see what it is. I, I see, I see your vibes, you know? Hmm. And so, I think... Mm, go ahead. Yeah, it's, yeah, and I think it's just um, a matter of you being able to swallow your pride, first of all. Because there's a lot of pride which goes into, you know, talking to a girl. You're like, you know, I, I, I'm cute. She's going she to be into me or what. But, um... I don't know. I'm a very genuine person, should I say? So I, I, I just be myself, and being myself is probably what got me over the finish line at the end of the day. Sure. Sure. Are you hearing it, Janzi? Swallow your pride. Yo, I feel like we need to repeat that one for for the Zimbos because pride did it for me the pride yeah, situation. Ah. And it's it's worse like for for a man who's probably been with a lot of women in general. You know what I mean? Right. They then begin to think, Oh, you know, I'm the shit, I'm this, I'm that. But if you're trying to take her seriously and you're not trying to treat her like, you know, yeah. Like 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 a side chick or whatever, yeah. then you know, there's a lot of things that you have to put aside to make it work. Because yeah. if you don't it probably won't. Tell me something. There's a, there's a, I don't know if I should call this a rumor or it's kind of the word going around in the diaspora streets, King Pharaoh, that uh, Zim guys, they're great and everything, but yeah. you've got to be careful because they're very tricky. They're <laughs> very tricky and. Shanzi, what? They're very tricky and they, yeah, they're not, they're not the most faithful. What do you have to say about that, sir? What I have to say is every single type of man from whatever country has their fair share of unfaithful people. I find it wrong to try and pin that on all of us, even if the majority, as people would say, is full of unfaithful people, right? Because, I don't know, all my friends, all my male friends that I have who are, like, in my inner circle, we are faithful. All of us. (laughs) Like, we don't see any other way about it. Like, if you want to cheat on somebody, you know, just break up with them. Why why you got to put somebody through that hurt that you wouldn't want to go through yourself? A lot of people then stop being self-conscious and saying, you know, I don't want this to happen to me but I'm going to do it to somebody else. Like, that, that doesn't make any sense. Sure. Wisdom. Sure. Wisdom. Mm, King Pharaoh, there's a lot of depth there. There's a lot of depth there. I love that. And I love that you are an observer, but that kind of can be very scary. Because once you have someone that is an observer, you know, you talked about body language and all of that. It means that now you can see even stuff that we maybe don't want to communicate. 
if you know what I mean. Like we're saying, oh no, King, I don't want you, I don't want you. Yet our body language is saying something else. But we want to put up a front and play, play hard to get. Oh, that's that that that's another thing. Um, if if I'm told that you know I don't want none, I'll listen to that over the whole body language thing, because at the end of the day, it's about what's said, right? Yeah. What's not said is always the trickiest part of every situation. Yeah, 100%. 100%. I've got a message here saying, observers are the future of the world. So there you go. Thank you very much. I, lo- I love you. Wherever you are, I love you. Thank you. <laughs> Oh man, we've got to wrap this up now, King Pharaoh. But just just the last one before we go. Um, where where are we going? Where are we going? We've started now in 2020 with our music. Um, where's the future for you? Where are you looking to? Where are you looking to go? I'm looking to go to the furthest place an artist can go. Hmm. You know, I'm not I'm not putting a limit on myself because I've seen a lot of people who I look up to do great things you know what i'm saying like there's I'll, I'll name one artist that i know who's doing great and, I, and i've known this guy for a couple of years now and it's like just watching him progress has been the most amazing thing you know um you guys probably know him it's daryl oh daryl yeah yeah like um I, i've known this guy um for for a little bit not too long but like a little bit and the time that I knew him, the music he was making then and what he's making now, like, you guys would be amazed at the difference. Like, and watching that happen is like, yo, this guy is the yeah. definition of put your mind to it and, and get it done. Yo, you know, we play, we actually play some Daryl here on After Five. Uh, believe you me, believe it or not, I mean, I don't want to believe you me. How you can tell this is a Zababian speaking, believe you me. um so wow that's amazing you know it's it's really good and i hope that you can kind of keep keeping in touch with him because once you you know have someone that you look up to that's that close uh it helps it really helps with the with the grind with the with the hustle oh hell yeah like in my head it's always just you know like i I don't know every, every person who I'm friends with as an artist. I, I don't think I'll be friends with you as an artist if I'm not a fan first. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, with this guy, I'm actually a fan, you know? And I'm just, I'm a fan, a coworker, whatever, you know? Uh, I don't even know whatever you want to call it because it's you know, the same line of work. But yeah, I'm, I'm just a big fan, if I'm being honest. Yo, and as am I, actually. Uh, he's... He's got a Samantha song that I'm going to play um, as a as a sign off. Um, oh, yes, sir. All right. All right. That, that, new, that new Samantha song with Gary Mapanzo as a remix. Yes. Oh, yes. I've been jamming that. I've been jamming that. It's such a vibe. You need to tell Daryl that we're jamming it over here. And yeah, maybe we can um, get to chatting with him as well. That would be lovely to to get his perspective on the grind, you know, and how it's been so far. Oh yeah, definitely. I can see what I can do. Um, but you know what? From us here at After Five, you know, from the Nightcap fam, we just want to say congratulations. Thank you like, very much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, man. No, we're really stoked for you. And you know what I'm gonna say to you is, listen, keep pushing. The road is not an easy road. Okay. It's not an easy road, and yeah. I'm sure I'm sure you know that. There will be ups, there will be yeah. high highs, and there will be low lows. Um, this is what life is, you know, that, that we can't avoid. But what counts, uh, my friend, uh, what counts is how you keep going, you know, um, whether you, you, you stop or, or you keep going, you know, get up, dust yourself off, and, and keep moving. So, yeah no from us over here we're wishing you all of the best we're definitely going to keep your song um in our lineup it will be on rotation um and yeah keep the hustle up thank you very much all love to the people at after five radio everybody listening please do 
go and stream can you see out now on our platform there we go and last um daryl i mean oh i'm not calling you daryl no oh my goodness king pharaoh um let us know once again uh where we can find your 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 music how we can contact you and then at the end would you give us a hi um everyone this is uh king pharaoh and you're tuned into the nightcap with samantha clare all right um my social media my instagram is king underscore pharaoh so you know p h a r o a r um and the link for the song is in my bio if you want to email me about me sending me a beat or you know whatever the email is on my instagram too and can you see is out everywhere so if you want to go on spotify on apple music google play youtube uh pandora music deezer uh iheart radio you know whatever you got yeah yeah Oh, and fantastic. thank you very much. This is King Pharaoh here with the Magic Lady, and you're listening to the Nightcap. Hey, 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 on After Five Radio. Lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. Thank you so much, King Pharaoh. Thank you. Thank it's, you. You have a good day. It's been a great have a pleasure. Night. You have a good night, too. Oh, well, it's a good day for you over there in Canada. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Cheers. Uh, we will talk soon. All right, see you soon. Goodbye.